Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down some Infect. We won the die roll. We will absolutely go first with this. Decent hand. I will keep it. Uh, some creatures, a Rancor, a Vines. Uh, yeah, it's decent. We will throw out our Augur. Pass to them, see what we're up against. Preordained. Okay, so we got to watch out for these counter spells. Good thing we can drop a creature turn two here. Get under it a little bit. All right, we will play out the mirror, and we will pass to them. Put a stop on our upkeep. And they'll see if they're brave enough to tap out when we got a infect creature on board. If they do, cool, more power to us. We're going to go ham. Ooh, we might actually get there. Augur. All right, they put up a blocker. That's good. They're going to need it. We're definitely going to run through that thing. Yeah, that was the best move they could. Lightning bolts. Ooh, is this Scred Delver again? Okay. Okay. I see you. Uh, yep. Let's draw our card. Forest. Let's get the Rancor going. We'll take full advantage of this trample while we have it. By playing the vines. He's going to get blocked, so he's going to get an extra buff, which is nice. Is he not blocking? Oh, well, that's just unfortunate then. Because now you die. I guess he had to take the gamble on if I had it or not. Uh, but if he had blocked, he would have gotten plus two, plus two. He would have become a 12-12. He would have blocked three of it. So he would have actually survived one more turn if he had blocked. Um, so not good on his part. Uh, so Scred, huh? We'll get our other Apostle's Blessing in here. Uh, do we want a Colony Garden? I don't think we need a Colony Garden. Hmm, Target Artifact. If this is Scred Delver, which it appears like it is, we're going to need this Relic. Could bring in the Plummets. We could drop. We usually can just drop a couple giant growths. So they're not the best. Since they don't have trample, you want to keep your trample as much as possible. Which is why I'm almost considering putting in another Llanowar Augur. I've only got three in here. Seal of Strength, I like. To just play with one plummet just as a backup sure we'll, we'll just put in one plummet uh, and then we need to cut one more thing do we just get rid of giant growth completely sure no giant growth hopefully that's the right move um hmm Wow. Do I want to risk it for this hand? We got good interaction. I'll keep. Don't know if it's the right move or not, but I'll keep. We got a relic. We got a Llanowar Augur. We might be a little bit behind, and they can start holding up the stuff they need, but we're going to try it. They have a stop at their upkeep. Ponder away. Is 
Is my audio even coming through? It doesn't even show it coming through. All right, well, we got another land. That's good. I think... I think, I think, I think... We'll put down the land of War Augur first. We'll go with the game plan. And later we can always crack a relic. If we need to. I don't know if that's the right line. But we will discover if it has the effect. Preordained. Might be digging for a mountain. Okay. Okay. That allows us to get down Blight Mamba. Although I would much rather, like, have a Glistener Elf here. So I can hold up an Apostle's Blessing. Mm, but again, I think we just gotta go for what we need to go for. And if we can't do it, then... Maybe we start swinging in with the Lana War Augur. <laughs> Who knows? It's a possibility. Definitely going to get their mountain with this. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Scred it out. It happens. Let's see what our draw is here. Forest. So do we go ham with the Lanawar Augur? We could. Definitely play... Yeah, we'll definitely play the Relic this turn. Yeah. I don't mind going ham with the, the Augur for a minute. Why not? We can protect it. We can larger than life it. We can crack this relic if we feel like we need to. And then we could sack it. Rancor will come back to hand if we do end up drawing, like, any type of creature or anything like that, so. Gotta do what you gotta do when you're infect, right? Gotta go for it. Just do it, Nike. Cycle the land. Absolutely, Snow Cover Island. Now they're just gonna hold up mana for a counter spell. Do I want to get an extra draw going? I kind of do. Get a Blight Mamba. That's nice. But will it resolve? Cancel. We'll swing in first with the Augur. Maybe get him to do something on this thing. Tap out a little bit. Looks like they are. Echoing Truth. Okay. That's fine. That allows me to get... Blight Mama down and hold the protection for it. Always got to keep a man out for the protection now, basically. Next turn we can larger than life, hold up Apostle's Blessing. Get in there for five. Then start dropping these Llanowar Augurs slowly. Llanowar Augur Rancor, Llanowar Augur Win. Something like that. 
That's how it sounds in my head. I just gotta hope they don't have too much scred. All we need to do is give protection from red, basically, if they ever try to go for it, so. They can still do a couple things with blue, like the snaps and stuff like that, echoing truth, but it is what it is. Tapping out for this. Uh, okay, cool. And we will say protection from red as we do. Boom. And they are tapped out for a turn. Which is excellent. This is why I wanted to keep this hand, just because of these two Apostle Blessing. Let's see what we draw. Another forest. That's nice. So now we can Rancor. Larger than life. Get in there for six poisonous. Taking the full brunt, so we're actually getting in for seven. How nice. Hold up that Apostle's Blessing. Now we're gonna then we'll start holding up regeneration. Alright. Let's see if this resolves. I don't know if it will. They may have that counter spell back up. There's the dispel. Alright. Uh okay. Yeah, I mean we did what we could with that one. Looks like we're back to the drawing board with the Land of War Augers. Getting in there with the Fairy Seer. Two cards left in hand. Just give me a good draw. Give me a creature. There we go. Alright. Now we setting up big. Now we setting up really big. Oh yeah, you know what's happening. Uh, we will wait to play that. Till next turn. And just pretend like maybe we got more stuff here, but... Just no removal for one turn, and I think we'll be okay. That uh, okay, sure. He wants to get in for that one extra damage. Oh, he's gonna ninjutsu for something. Mm, I should have seen that coming. I should have seen that coming. They used their red, though, for that. That might have been a mistake, unless they are sitting on a mountain here. Um, yeah, they used their red. I don't know if that was a mistake or not, but maybe they're just looking for another Echoing Truth or Snap or something like that. But, uh, yeah, we won. We got our two augers down. We were coming in for a lot of trample next turn, so there wasn't much they could do. Sweet, so we won against Is It Scred? Pretty sweet. Make sure to leave a like if you're enjoying the fun infect randomness every week uh leave a comment below what you guys think about the deck if i should uh switch it up a little bit more bring in another one of these land of war augers i think he is particularly good in this matchup uh but yeah let me know what you guys think and uh stay tuned more for more videos we got naya slivers tomorrow i'll talk a little bit more about the tournament uh not the tournament the league that we were just in uh yesterday was our final video for it if you haven't seen that make sure to check that out link in the bio and stay tuned tomorrow. I'll talk a little bit more about the league in the next uh, Nice Lovers video as well. So uh, we will see you guys in the next video.